Starting us off with the fabled one arm dab over here. Welcome one and all to the community Twitch stream on the Upland channel. I am your host, your friendly neighborhood lighted up Dan. How are we all doing? Who have we got over here? Let's test the waters. Let's see if the sneaking suspicion, the intuition, the premonition was indeed correct Amundo. Over here we've got Neptune, Lightning Leg, Captain Space Chimp, Dan Ovidal, Dr. Fairweather, Elijah Judah, Coronacos, Drifter, Cyberclay, Caesar, Rock Drigo, who's just gone for a shower or about to get in the shower, Joey Sly, Vlads, Capitivo, Betts, who else? Who else? C Prado's here. As well. Hey QB. Running920. B Man Fu. Harry Sipa. Edson. Dude Heister. Louie. My gosh. Oh my goodness. Velo Yellow's here. Laban's here. OG Killer. Surfman. Oh boy. Nova Scottia says hi. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. What's up? Great to see you. Welcome on in, first time chatters, if it's your first time here, or if you have, you're a returning member of the community, if you've been here a bunch of times. It's great to see you. Welcome to the community Twitch stream. We do this every Tuesday, 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. PT. We used to do it Tuesdays and Thursdays, but for now, we've just knocked it back to just Tuesdays. For now, for now. Ralph69 underscore is here as well. Excellente. We also take these streams that we do every Tuesday, 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. PT. We also put them on our YouTube channel and our various social media as well. So if you miss it, it's no problem. You've always got time to catch it up on Twitch for seven days before it's removed. But we even do one further. We put it up on our socials and our YouTube channel as well. So you can watch it forever. It's there preserved. Which is just beautiful, isn't it? just beautiful it's just what you need so either you're watching now live here on twitch or you're watching from the future say hi youtube chat we'll see the chat pop up on screen say hello youtube hi youtube hi future viewers yeah beautiful just beautiful hello future look at this look at this hello future beautiful just beautiful all right friends what i thought we'd do today is we would um check out some more mini games that are in beta you know or um and do some racing as well do some racing with stakes yeah yeah very good a very very good so the fantastic uh mr alan c and his suffix mini games uh are so so much fun so moorish yeah and he's actually got another one out he's got another one that's out in testing right so let's go have a little luke look i'll maybe go on to this one over here let's switch it up over here suffix skill meets upix this is mr allen c's mini games now these won't necessarily all be he mentioned this in a tweet that these won't necessarily all be making the cut. It's just experimenting with different ones and checking out different ones, putting them out into like sort of beta testing. Mm -hmm. So it might not be all of these which are then submitted, which are then like finalized, all that sort of stuff. So definitely go check these out. If you haven't checked this out before, I highly recommend that you do. I'll grab you the link. It's just suffix.me. Go check them out. Uh, the brand new one is scuba steve yeah which is just such a good time you might have heard of flappy bird before i don't know if you have or haven't but if you heard of the the sensational game that is flappy bird this is a take on flappy bird yeah this is an iteration of flappy bird and all you got to do is you got to tap if you're on mobile or click 
if you're on PC, if you're on browser like me right now. And then each time you do, you will go higher and higher and higher. Now, I'm not sure if browser is a little bit quicker than mobile. Like, um, oop, and then you have to keep on the screen. Oh, oh boy. Oh, boy. I was set up. I was set up. How was I supposed to get past that? How was I supposed to make it past that? Set up. Absolute set up. All right, let's go. Nearly failed on the first one. Oh, holy coins. This is going to be my best score because of because of all the coinage. This is just, this is just beautiful. Set up. Set up. That's my top score. That's my top score. Have any of you folks played Scuba Steve? He's one bad mother. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah. For Italian cooking, ask here. Oh, oh, okay. Are we to come to you for our Italian cooking questions, Capitivo? Is that what we are to do? Oh, what I, did I put this on full screen? I didn't mean to put this on full screen. Let me turn that not on full screen. Because I didn't want that. And then move that over there. Very good. Very good. Very, very good. Okay. Excellent. Just ask if I need. Okay. All right. Very good. Oh, boy. So you gain a point for each barrier you pass. And then, there's, of course, there's all these points for picking up the coins as you go, as you go by, too. One point for the bronze ones, two points for the silver ones, and three points for the gold ones. This is my high score again because of all the coinage. Because of all the excellent coinage. What? Rigged. Rigged. How did that happen? I don't believe you. You're a liar. Well played. Flappy Llama. Yeah, it's Flappy Bird. It, it's like a it's, a, it's a, it's an iteration of Flappy Bird, right? The game's too hard for you. Best for you to, is, is to continue cooking. Okay, what are you cook? What are you cooking? What sort of things do you cook up? So that's Scuba Steve. Um, I think I did pretty well there. What's your high scores? Anyone got a higher score than me? I got 107. Was that? That was beautiful. That was just beautiful. Um, Ninja Jump feels like you can just play forever. So we're not going to play that one. Suffix workforce. Uh, Suffix workforce is pretty fun. Uh, you, basically, there's this, like, there's a moving, there's a moving crane. Holy cats! Right, let's, um, <laughs> how do we, let's disable that. <laughs> right, so there's this moving crane at the top over here, right? And you need to, you need to click to get it to land on this. And it's sort of like, uh, it's sort of like Jenga, right? It's gonna be a bit wibbly, a bit a bit, a bit wibbly, a bit wobbly. So we've got to let it get to the middle, and then boom! Boish! Look at that. Okay, one. Okay, let's go. That one was more central. Oh, oh, wow, that flopped all the way to the left there. Okay, gotta try and even it out a little bit. Oh boy, it went even more left. Come on now. That's even further left. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. And, okay, is this okay? Oh, boy. Dan's Tower. Yeah, that's right. I think we've, I think we've kind of got it central again now. Just, we can't, we can't mess it up. We just need to keep it central. Oh, that was a bit quick. I went a little bit quick there. And again, getting a bit confident here. Just want to make it to 10. If we can make it to 10, I'm a wiener. Did it. Did it. Made it to 10. This is beautiful. Oh, the crane. Did the crane get... Did you notice that? The crane just went faster. That's crazy. Oh, boy. Here we go. 13. That's that's wibbling and wobbling. Don't you do it. Don't you topple. That's going really well. You don't get the content. Is this about Upland? Yeah, this is a mini game. That's be that has been made and it's in it's currently in beta. It's in testing. This is a mini game for uh for like the Upland mini games for layer two experiences, right? Yeah. You think you see it speeding up? I I pre I'm pretty sure it sped up after like ten, right? 
Pretty sure after about 10, it sped up. SE Kicker, how are you? Keeping it moist, Rodrigo, as we do. You know how we do. Dola the Dollar Llama, hello. Can we make it to 20? I think I can make it to 20. I think I can make it to 20. It's getting a little bit... Okay, it's... It's a bit jiggly. She's got a bit of jiggle on her. This one. Okay. Go left. Go a little bit left. I made it... To, did it speed up again? Did that just speed up again? Did you see that at 20? Holy... Wibble wobble Batman. <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> Oh boy. But it only takes it only takes the tower that's like on screen into account, as far as I can tell. Because if it was counting it from all the way at the beginning, this would have toppled like ages ago. But I suppose that's that's like how the game works, right? Otherwise it just it wouldn't it wouldn't work properly. That's really far right. Oh boy. Oh 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 Don't you Don't you do it? No, no! No! <laughs> huh. Huh. Keep it central. Easy 30. Come on, let's do we can do this, Devin. We can do easy 30. Nope. Stop. Stop. Stop wobbling! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> oh. 28! That was pretty good! Can anyone beat 28? First of all. I want to see if you can... Can you beat 107 on Scuba Steve? Can you beat 107 on Scuba Steve? And can you beat 28 on the, on the tower? Because, uh, just saying, I rocked that. You can't beat two on what? On Scuba Steve? I absolutely rocked that. That was beautiful. Um, I quite like this one. This one's quite fun. The, the suffix Halloween game. This one's quite fun. It's like, it's basically like a Candy Crush sort of game. Right? How do I mute this thing? <gasps> right, beautiful. Right, okay. But you can kind of go in like, in different directions. You can go in diagonals as well, which is, which is pretty nifty. And you build up score by getting, I think it's more than, more than five at a time and the higher up you go the higher up like the multiplier goes and then by doing that you add like you can add time that's that's sort of how it works so four doesn't really get you anything but if you go five and higher then then you're cooking right well where is everything nothing's connecting this is crazy speak i need to i, I need some I need, I need some time here i'm running out of time this isn't going well at all Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, that was that was that was a rubbish run. But to be fair, I spent a lot of it turning off the volume, so that's that's not really my fault. You know what I mean? I don't think I should be penalized for that necessarily. Not really cool. Oh, look at this! I just lined up the ghosties like crazy. Look at this. Oh, I should have actually no. That would that would have sort of been the same thing anyway. That was beautiful. It was beautiful. Are there any fives that I can line up? Don't not seen any fives. Not seen any fives. We'll just go for a, a, tr a tree. A trick or tree over there. Four ghosties. So let's get the let's get the five witches. Witches get stitches, baby! Alright, what else? Got four witches there. That's no good. Four ain't no good, really. We don't need four. We need five. What? 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 I'm not having a good. I'm not having good runs this time round. This is terrible. This is awful. But I will. Yeah. Just you watch. Just oh, cr oh. That was rubbish. How could you? How could you do me like that? It's cheating. Should have gone that way for the ghosties. Messed up. Oh, there's ghosties everywhere. That could have been an absolutely crazy combo. But I uh, ruined it. 
you know sometimes that sometimes that just happens you've got a crazy awesome looking combo on your hands and then you just you just go ahead and absolutely ruin it because of the smoothness of your brain yeah sometimes that just happens you can't help it sometimes the smooth brain just takes over and you and you have to and you have to just accept it yeah but that's okay it happens it happens to the best of us or oh, which way around do i want to go i'm gonna go here 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 oh yo damn Okay, look look at this. Look at this alien combo. I'm trying to I'm trying to quick maths it in my head to get the maximum output. Did you see that? That was crazy. What was that? My goodness me. Okay, maximum maximum combo. We can go this way, this way. This way. Wowza. That's good. That's good. Very nice. Very nice. Look at this. Now we're cooking. I I didn't do that. You're a liar. That's just beautiful. That is just beautiful. Uh, let's go this way and then we'll go up here. Don't worry, friends. I'll be with you in a minute. I'm just a little bit... I'm a little bit busy right now with Suppix Halloween Candy Crush. Okay? A little bit busy. Be with you in just a moment, friends. Don't worry about it. It's going to be okay. Don't see any fives. Just seeing fours. This could... This could get bad real fast. This could get bad real quick. Oh, boy. Oh, goodness. Okay. It's it, it it's it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> but that's a new high score, I do believe. Thirteen thousand nine hundred and forty-five. Very good. Looks like fun. It is. It's lots of fun. Crypto Crewman, hello. What is this game? This is the Suppix games by the wonderful Mr. Alan C. Yeah, these are all mini games that are in beta that he is uh, he has um, developed. For like the mini game challenge for layer two experiences in upland so they're not all gonna necessarily be added to to upland or he's not going to necessarily finalize them all and, and submit all of them but these are, these are the ones that he has been uh working on over here so definitely go check them out he's got a, a bunch of like your, your favorites and your classics reimagined rejigged to have like a bit of an upland spin on it right so definitely go check them out. They're really, really cool. This is exactly the sort of stuff that we had in mind when we were thinking about like lay two experiences in terms of like having games in them and uh, for our mini game challenge and stuff like that. This is exactly the sort of stuff that we've had in mind, right? As we, we feel like maybe folks were going a little bit too complicated with it like immediately and that's fine. It's great to be ambitious. It's great to shoot for the stars. And some of the stuff that we've already got uh, integrated in Upland is very cool. Like World of Football, like Upland Kingdoms, like uh, Uplandia. All very cool. All very, very exciting. Uh, and I know folks are developing uh, lots of different sort of like 3D games as well. You know, that's, that's all well and fine. That's all excellent. But you can take a step back. You can make it a little bit more simple, a little bit more simplified. Something really cool, really exciting, like a classic mini game, like head-to-head -head Tetris or head-to-head -head Pong or um, head-to-head Checkers, Chess. That, you know, that, that sort of stuff doesn't need to be overly complicated. It just needs to be fun. It needs to be fun. It needs to be engaging. It needs to be Moorish. You want it to be Moorish. You want to play and play and play. And then you can imagine, you can envisage like a virtual arcade that costs Upix to play each time, or, uh, but but then you've got a chance to go on leaderboards, and then weekly leaderboards gets an Upix, Upix payout. Something like that. Some sort of system, some sort of way where you can, you can earn Upix by playing it in some way, shape or form. A bit like racing with stakes. You see how racing with stakes is working right now? If you're, if you're, if you're creating a race that's with stakes, 
everyone has to pay the stake who wants to join in the race but then if you come in the first three places you can walk away with some more epics than what you put in of course third place kind of really only gets their entry fee back but first and second place depending on the size of the stake can walk away with a decent sum right so that's that's the sort of these are the sort of ideas that we've got knocking around this is how we envisage layer two experiences this is how we see layer two experiences right this is what we're thinking alice alice silver hello how are you are you okay you got twenty thousand six hundred and forty five. nice bets very nice very good right i fancy going on scuba steve again folks listen i want to go on scuba steve again okay yeah, this is this. These are by the wonderful Mr. Alan C, UCN member. He is a brilliant UCN and and UDN, I presume, as well because of they, these. Here we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah, straight to thirty-one. That's what I'm talking about. The gold coins right at the start. Then silver coinage, beautiful. Why? Yeah, this one's like Flappy Bird. This one's like a this one's like a, a an iteration of Flappy Bird, right? Very cool. Flappy Llama. You got 35? <laughs> Sticky, hello. My top score is 107. But I'm not gonna lie, I got most of it from coins. <laughs> so the 107 might look like a really impressive score. But really, I just got lucky with coins. Oh, that was unfair. Come on. Come on. How was I supposed to? How was I supposed to manage that one? You, you're killing me. You're killing me here. Three. 115, 125. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna have to beat your scores, friends. I'm gonna have to get above 115 and 125. Gonna have to. Yeah. Unless, unless I get cheated by the game. Yeah. You know what I mean? What am I supposed to do here? What am I so <laughs> This isn't right. This isn't right. This shouldn't be happening to me. I'm too beautiful for this. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm far too beautiful for this. Oh, 53. Gold coinage. I missed one. Missed a gold coin. It's fine. <gasps> Stay in the middle. Stay in the middle. Missed a bit of coinage. Gold coins. 133. 135. Oh my goodness. Look who's just set the new high score, friends. Look who's just set the new high score to beat. Nearly clicked off the screen. <laughs> Got too excited. <gasps> Can I break 200? Can I? Oh, so close. 197. Woo! Did you get 200? Oh, you, 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 were, you were cheering me on to get 200. The screen's too narrow. You can't see far ahead. The eye... The, it's because these are they're, they're designed for mobile games as well. So like it's it's one game whether you're playing on browser or on mobile. So I I assume I presume that's why that that is. Tracy, hello. GG, good game, good game. Oh boy. Watch your head, if not watch your mouth. <laughs> we did it, friends. 197. Let's see if you can beat my score. Yeah. Let's. Oh, let me to do that. See if you can beat my score on that. 197. I think that was pretty good. The only one I can't really play here, um, and Miss Allen C is aware of this, is this one, Suffolk Speedway. This one's really it's a really fun game, but the correct speed of it is it is on mobile. For some reason, when I play it on browser, I'm not sure if it's on all browsers, I'm not sure if it's on all desktops, all operating systems. I'm on Windows, I'm on Edge, a very, very standard configuration. And when I play Suffolk Speedway on browser. Oh, God! <laughs> wow! My ears! Okay. For some reason, when I play um, Suffolk Speedway on, um, on browser, 
on Windows. It uh, it's it's just really fast. It's like twice. It's like double the speed. So it's it's, it's really fast. <laughs> I suppose it's playing the game on hard mode, right? <laughs> it's it's just like ultra hard mode. But I have to, I've tested it on my mobile, on my on my iPhone, on iOS, and it's like half the speed of this, and it's it's normal, and it's it's actually it's still it's still tricky. Don't get me wrong, you still have to have good reactions, but it's about half the speed, and it's like it feels it feels normal. For some reason, it's um on browser, it's just it's just super fast. Don't know why. I'm, you know, I've not played. I've not played the pinball game, and I've not played the speed pool game. Should we play the speed pool game? Good morning, Memphiatle. How are you? This one's on its side, but it says mobile. That's pretty neat. Oh, there's pizza here. There's, there's a there's a bottle of drink or something. There's Scuba Steve. There's a suffix car. Turn the music off. Okay. What's, what the? What's going on? What's what's happening? Oh, oh. I got the weakest power when I did that. Didn't mean to do that. Can I just can I just like hit any ball, or do I have to get a particular order? Am I allowed to just am I allowed to just sink them as they come? Boosh. It's on mobile as well, but it, it's uh, it's on but it's web page on mobile. There there is no app, I believe, yet or or at all or what have you. That was. Are you are you joking? I I I sunk that perfectly. Top left corner. <sighs> what was that? What was that? Come on, you're killing me here, people. That's what I meant. I meant the next one. Top left corner for the next one. That's what I meant. Did you see that? That was super skillful. That was crazy. Did you see that? That was crazy. Top left. I wasn't even looking at the power gauge. Oh, I actually got it! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> that was good. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Top right. Full power. How? Why did I go minimum power again? Why? Oh, come on! Give me a break, people. I don't think it does go minimum power. I think it's just showing that no matter what. Kind of. Yeah, it's just showing that. Right, okay. Look, this one's this one's going in. This one's going in. I've got this one. I I forgot to look at the power again. <sighs> A lot to think about here, people. You know what I mean? I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna have to pow those balls around. I'm just gonna have to pow That's not powing them! You need to pow it. This game's hard. This game is extremely difficult. Right, let's go. Boom. Forgot about the power. Sunk the white ball. That's a foul. Boosh. Okay, 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 okay. This is this is flawless. Apparently not. This is flawless. That you're a liar. You're a liar. Watch this. Knew it. Knew it. Did forget to look at the power again, though. Not going to lie. Oh, why? I gave it too much juice. Beautiful. Middle, middle top. Yeah? You watching? Middle top. You watching? Who's watching? You watching? Middle top. Never mind. This game's cheating me. But that's fine. It happens. It happens. Woo! Hey, Lara. Do I still play Up Upland Kingdoms and Uplandia? I haven't logged into either of them for quite some time. Last time I played Uplandia was the... Uh, and, and Upland Kingdoms, actually, was the... Um, you know the Tokyo Quest Line stuff that they did? That was the last time that I played those two. Oh, 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 that one's going in as well. Oh, come on now. Don't do this to me. Come on now. Come on now. How about yourself? 
Lara J, are you still playing them both? Nice, nice. Go, go, go. Come on now. Just a, li a little bit of juice. There we go. Okay, still too much juice. Not going to lie. Still a little bit too much juice. That was a lot of juice. Ugh. Oh, boy. Look at that. What's the aim of playing these mini games? What's the reward? Up Spark. Nothing for now because they're not actually integrated into Upland right now. But we have a mini game challenge that's running. And then once they're integrated into Upland, there might be specific mechanisms for them. Like, like how we got racing with stakes, right? There might be things like that. There might be leaderboards. Um, there might be other, other opportunities and ways to like to gain from them. But that is still something that's like too TBD. You feel me? But that can go in lots of different directions, honestly. We're not decided one way or another. That can go in many different directions. And I think that's part of what's so exciting about this is like, hey, look, let's say we've got, let's say Mr. Allen C goes ahead with Suppix Speed Pool, right? How do we, how do we like gamify that within Upland, within Upland systems? How do we do that? What do you want to see? What would, how would you do it? Would you do an entry fee per game? Would you do weekly leaderboards? Would you do daily leaderboards? How would you do it? How would you go about it? You know what I mean? Be really interested. Come on! Forgot about the power meter. <laughs> Would be really interested to hear about that, right? Because it doesn't have to be a one one size fits all solution either, right? It doesn't have to be a one size fits all solution. It could be like, oh, for one of them, it's weekly leaderboards. For another one, it's daily leaderboards. For another one, it's this, it's that, or whatever, really. Bro. You're killing me. Okay, middle, bottom. You watching? Middle, bottom. Middle, bottom. Never mind. This is going in. Knew it. I knew that was going in. There's no way it wasn't. Okay. Uh, yeah, nice. Nice and gentle. I gave it too much juice. I didn't mean to give it that much juice. Can I just pot this one whenever? Oh, damn. That looked like it didn't even move. <laughs> it's normally the black's at the end, isn't it? But YOLO. Sink it now. I think you can just sink it whenever. I don't think there's any rules of, like, the order that you need to do things in. I think the idea of this is just pot them all as quickly as you can, right? I think that's, that's the rules for this one. Middle bottom. You watching? Middle bottom. Yeah? Gave it too much. As long as it's skills and, and no gambling. Yeah, we, we... Once something becomes gambling, the legislation surrounding it becomes very, very strict and the whole thing gets very complex and very messy. So, like, so we wouldn't do that. Yeah. Record 434 seconds. Not my best performance, I'm not going to lie, but that was tough. Darts Championship? Darts would be cool. Darts would be cool. Upland's becoming the game of all games. Well, that was the idea, wasn't it? The whole idea that we've had with this is, yeah, Upland is... First and foremost, predominantly a property trading game, right? But it's also this platform for experiences. It's this platform for like layer two experiences, layer two services, layer two games, mini games. You know, you've got things like Uplandia, Upland Kingdoms. You've got things like um, the Upic Spark Exchange. As like a service, you know, you got things like that, right? So it's a very cool, exciting time. This whole concept of the, you know, the, the super app, the platform for experiences, the platform for layer two things. Very cool. Very, very exciting. I think, um, I think we are all here 
very early on, right? And I think it's difficult because we can see the vision. A lot of us can see the vision. We can see the potential and the opportunities that are here. But we're, we're, we're very early, right? We're very, very sort of early on. So it's really exciting. A lot of cool things can happen moving forwards. And we just hope that um, by working together and by, um, you know, by by working together and by promoting your fantastic ideas and, and products and services and all that sort of stuff, uh, that we'll get some really cool things moving forwards, right? Omkina, hello. Do we have any news about treasure hunting? No, no news, nothing to update. As we posted in our announcements, this is something that's not going to be a quick fix. It's not going to be something that there's going to be any change around anytime soon. So look at it as like a long-term thing that treasure hunting for web has been disabled. Not going to be anytime soon. To so manage your expectations on that. It, it might not be, it might not be ever again. It might be several months. It, we don't know. Right now, it's long-term. Yeah. Yo, friends, friendos, friendos. That was Mr. Allen C's Suffix minigames. We did a whole thing on Mr. Allen C's Suffix minigames. I didn't actually mean to. I was going to do some racing, but we are actually are, we're kind of low on time here. So I think we're going to we're going to skip the racing with stakes. And I think we're going to do what we're going to do is we're going to hop into some juicy, tasty giveaways over here. What do you think? But we need to, we need a keyword. Any idea what the next Spark Week is? If and when there is a next Spark Week, we will announce through the usual channels, Neptune. So keep an eye on official channels, official announcement channels, event page, all that sort of stuff. Keyword suffix. Are you sure there's no way to cheat from the phone? I am I personally sure that there's absolutely no way to cheat and exploit from phone? No, I'm not. But what I do know is it's much, much harder to do cheats and exploits through like apps through phones than it is through web, which runs on like, you know, like JavaScript, CSS, all that sort of stuff, right? Okay. Anything new on Sparklet? Nothing new on Sparklet? No? Nothing new to announce? Okay, Suffix is the keyword we're going for. Everyone's typing it in as if it's live. It's not live, but it is live now! Okay, now, type it in. Type Suffix into the chat to be entered into the giveaways, friends. Okie dokie. So, for the giveaways, we have the Livestream Block Explorer. An exclusive Block Explorer, which you can only win during these up and community streams over here. Yes? Yes, very good, very nice. It is a golden microphone that's on a stand. It's got this bow tie. And it's got these silver sound waves coming out of it. It's very cool, it's very nice. Some terms and conditions surrounding the Livestream Block Explorer giveaway and the Upix giveaway that we're gonna do over here. These are in no way endorsed by or affiliated with Twitch. These are just our own giveaways here from Upland. Uh, the Livestream Block Explorer is one per player. If you've already won it before, you will not be eligible to win it again. And instead, you will win the Upix. Your account must be in good standing. You can't be banned. You can't be an Alcatraz. You cannot be a general menace to society. Yeah? You know what I'm saying? You know who you are. You know who you are. All right. Um, what else? Your account must be Uplander status and above. That is to preserve the mint number total of the Livestream Block Explorer. If we allowed visitors to get it, they might decide that they're not going to play Upland anymore for whatever reason or just forget. And then boom, poof, vanished. So we can't have that. And the Livestream Block Explorers are dropped once every few weeks. Yeah, so if you do win it, if you do win the giveaway over here, do not be alarmed if you haven't received it for, for a few weeks because they're dropped in batches. Okay, whereas the Upix is dropped very quickly, either the same day or early tomorrow. All right. Okay. Friends, best of luck to one and all of you. Okay? We're going to do it.
Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. The Big the Head, head 85. 85. Oh. The Big Head 85. GG's. Congratulations. Can we get some GG's in chat for the Big Head 85? Congratulations, friend. You did the thing. I'm so proud of you. I knew you had it in you. My friend. What is your Upland username? I will make a note of it. And then we will see if you've won this live stream block explorer before. You know? Yo, Sticky Bandits. Appreciate you. I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. Is it your first time here? Have you been here before? We're, uh, we're like a... It's like a community within the community, right? The, the, the community live stream is like a community within the Upland community. There's a lot, a lot of really good people here. The Big Head. Okay, I've made a note. You are the B.E. Wienor. Let me just double... Why is it sign me out? Hold on. Wants me to verify that it's me. Who else would it be? Hey, Google. Who else would it be? All right, let me have a let me have a look. As far as I can see, you've not won the live stream block explorer before, so you are down as the live stream block explorer Weenor. You are the BE Weenor. You did it. Woo! All right. Next up, who is going to win the five K epics? Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. Dutty Damien. Oh. Oh. It's beautiful. Dutty Damien, congratulations. Can we get some GGs in chat for Dutty Damien, the Wienor? The Upix Wienor. Dutty Damien, what is your Upland username, my friend? Is it is it Damianto? Is it Damien2? I feel like it's... I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Damianto. Damian Toe. The Upix Wienor. I've made a note of you, my friend. Congratulations, you did the thing. That's 5k Upix coming your way. It pays to come out to the stream. If you keep repeating Suffix, does it increase your odds or are people just repeating a bunch just because? If you keep repeating Upix, it only re increases your odds of lightning striking you. Yeah? Or at least I pray for that. Yeah? In answer to your question, no, it doesn't. You just <laughs> you only need to type it in once. The people who keep spamming it just love to just just they're just that sort of person, you know? They just love to be they just love to be that sort of person. Like Joey, like Joey over here. You know? Like good old Joey. Thor vibes, free electricity. <laughs> <laughs> all right friends that's all we've got time for this that actually honestly that actually went by really quickly didn't it thanks to mr allen c's mini games right probably because of the speed pool the speed pool yeah probably because of that probably why it made it go by so quickly because after i finished my round of that it was like the end of the day <laughs> All right, friends, that's going to be us wrapping up over here. You know where to find us. If you need your community team, if you need your community managers, we are available through in-game chat. Just drop us a DM through there, or you can get a hold of us through Discord. DM any of the community team. You can see us uh, on the top in red names. Hit us up if you need us, or just like drop, or just like post a message in general. You know, and tag us in it or something. Whatever. And you can also grab us through our uh, social media channels as well. Because we are active on those too. Alright, friends. Thank you so much. I will see you again next week. Same time. Same place. Tuesday, 8am PT. But until then, peace.